we are on day. I'm gonna need some help here. Fifteen. Woo! You know what that means? That means we're ten days away from Christmas, Sam. I don't know about you, but I'm extremely excited. I am extremely excited. <sighs> extremely excited. That's gonna be a lot of fun. I am so excited. So I would like to start our day off on this Xmas. Ooh. Advent calendar. You see what I did there? I like that. It's saying Christmas. Like now, isn't and that like take, uh, taking Christ out of Yeah. Him? Actually, no. Tell me about and it. some people have always thought that that's what it is, but it is not. Actually, the X, when you see X must, X is the Greek symbol for Christ. Oh. So when you see X must, it's really Christ. This Christmas. Oh, so it's literally, it's just a, it's like a symbol. Yes. Yeah. So it's, people say Xmas. It's not that they don't want to say Christmas. <laughs> Xmas means Christmas. That's it's not like saying happy holidays. That's not the same thing. No. You're, you're not taking Christ out of Christmas. No. You're just, that's just the Greek. Another, uh, yeah. Another it's word a for different it. way to say it. That's cool. That's yeah. cool. That's good to know. Um, so today we're talking about another, uh, another thing from Isaiah. Isaiah actually had a lot of uh, prophecies I really Jesus liked it. Yeah, yeah it was really good. Um, so you guys get to read it, but he, uh, Isaiah describes Jesus coming as the good shepherd, right? Um, he's described as a good shepherd, and he cares for everyone. If you know anything about shepherd, they care for a flock of sheep, and the shepherd cares about his right. sheep. And he doesn't care about all of us as a big herd, right? He doesn't think of us as just a big group of people, but he cares for each one of us. The one, you know, he'll leave the ninety-nine. He'll leave the ninety-nine. He'll find the one. Yes, and he'll he'll carry us close to his heart, and so he shows a lot of love like that. And how are we going to show that love today? I think, if I remember, right, correct me if I'm wrong, well, but I think we're gathering like socks and jackets mm -hmm. and gloves and shoes. And from, you know, from maybe your closet, maybe yeah. you don't wear them anymore, or maybe they were, maybe they were good and they just didn't fit you yeah. or where at, I mean, wherever they come, yeah. whatever it comes from, and you're going to take those to a local shelter. So yeah. we have the THS, you could probably take yeah. it to, uh -huh. um, what are some other places? I'm drawing um, a blank here. I bet the soup kitchen would soup have kitchen, resources. Yep. Um, and you can always look you can, online. You can also check with local schools. Yeah, they may local have, schools may need uh, check yep. and stuff too right. as well. Uh, we really want to show love like Jesus loves, and one of the ways we can do that is giving some warts to some other people who might not have access to that. So, that's a great one. Yeah, that's a great that's a great service opportunity. Yes, it really, like we've been saying, remembering Christ in this season is what's important. So these projects they let us see what Christ does yep. and how He loves. It's so, a great day for you to give. Yes. So it is. do it. Be generous today. Give those things from your closet and mm -hmm. from under your bed and stuff. And we will see you tomorrow. Bye.